In this video, let's explore the process of registering for the Informatica IDMC and seamlessly connecting it with Snowflake, leveraging the respective 30-day free trial. Navigate to the IDMC 30-day trial on the website. While there are several free trials accessible on the Informatica Cloud website, we recommend using the Marketplace IDMC free trial for comprehensive access to a wide array of services and options within IDMC. Proceed to create an account by providing the required information. Ensure that the data center is configured to North America to unlock additional IDMC services such as InfoCore etc., enhancing the breadth of features available during your trial period. Complete the registration process, agreeing to the terms and conditions. After successful registration, you should receive a confirmation email with instructions and access details. Click on Verify Me Now link in email to register your IDMC trial with your own password and security questions. This completes your IDMC trial registration which is now valid till next 30 days. Now let's log in into IDMC and set up Secure Agent. Go into Administrator Service. Click on Runtime Environment. Download the Secure Agent and select Windows as the platform and click Download. After the download finishes, initiate the installation by clicking on the installer file. Once the installation concludes, a pop-up will prompt you to register the Secure Agent. Enter the username of the IDMC environment and generate a token from the IDMC in the Runtime Environment tab. Copy and paste the token, then click Register. Please allow 10 to 15 minutes for the services to fully initialize. You can monitor the progress of the services in the installation pop-up. Now let's view the status of Secure Agent in IDMC environment. Back to IDMC, you can see the Runtime Environment created with the machine name. Click on the Runtime Environment to view the status of different services in IDMC. Few are still starting up while few are up and running. If some services are not visible in the list, you can manually enable them in the Runtime Environment. Simply click on the three dots, select Enable or Disable Services, Connectors, and activate additional connectors and services for your IDMC org. Time to sign up for the Snowflake Free Trial, a crucial step for our upcoming IDMC connection. Complete the required fields, hit continue. Choose the standard edition and your preferred cloud provider, preferably AWS, then click get started. After completing the registration, expect an email with your username and login URL. Click login and proceed to set up your credentials. Log into Snowflake using the provided URL from the email. Upon logging in, you'll notice a default shared database and app. Let's go ahead and create a new database for our IDMC connection, serving as both source and target. Provide a preferred name for your database and click Create. After successfully creating the database, proceed to create a new schema and assign it a suitable name. Once the schema is established, navigate to the worksheet and ensure all necessary permissions are granted to the schema by executing the appropriate grant query. With the completion of the Snowflake database setup, Feel free to create separate schemas for sources and targets based on your needs. Additionally, tables can be pre-created or generated at runtime to align with your IDMC mapping requirements. Now, let's proceed to set up the connection in IDMC. Access IDMC, head to the administrator service, and click on the connections tab to initiate a new connection. Assign a name, choose the connection type, and furnish the login details. In the advanced settings, ensure to input the role name and JDBC parameters, including warehouse, database, and schema names, as demonstrated in the connection. For further guidance, refer to the suggestions displayed on the right of the screen, explaining each parameter in the connection setup. Click on Test Connection to verify the connectivity. In the next step, let's create a sample mapping utilizing Snowflake as the target and a flat file connection pointing to the desktop. For the flat file connection, set the connection type as flat file and choose the previously configured runtime environment setup. Specify the path where the source files are located. Navigate to the data integration service, click on new to initiate the creation of a new mapping. This action will display a default source and target transformation in the design area. The source transformation is configured with the flat file connection, allowing you to preview sample data. Meanwhile, the target transformation is set up with the Snowflake connection we created earlier. Field mapping between the source and target transformations is visible. Moreover, you have the flexibility to incorporate additional transformations between your pipelines to refine and transform your data as needed. Click Run to execute the mapping. 
You'll witness the successful loading of records from source to target, and detailed statistics will be readily available. This concludes the demo for configuring Snowflake and IDMC's free trial. Feel free to explore more to discover the various services within IDMC.